In the summer of 2025, Russian blogs and telegram channels published information regarding the successful combat deployment of new airborne unmanned systems, low observable guided munitions S 71K and S 71M, by the multifunctional Sukhoi Su 57 fighter aircraft. The Sukhoi Su 57 is able to more effectively combat air defense systems due to its swift movement and difficult detection of these systems, which are a combination of a drone and a missile. The Sukhoi Design Bureau first introduced the S-71 in 2019. The system was enhanced following the start of the special military operation and the combat use of the Sukhoi Su-57 as a carrier of new weapon types. The design was simplified to reduce serial production costs and radar detectability was reduced. Additionally, the flight range was increased. This modification enabled the system to accommodate the modern demands of combat and the active use of the fighter. The S-71 design is identified by a trapezoidal fuselage that is designed to minimize observability, a folding sweep wing, and inverted V-shaped all-moving stabilizers. The air intake is situated at the rear. The TRDD-50 turbojet turbofan engine is identical to those used in the KH-101 and KH-59M Russian missiles. The maximum speed is approximately 730 to 950 km per hour, up to 0.6 Mach, and the operational altitude is up to 8,000 meters. The system is produced in two versions. The first variation is the S-71K, Cover, or Carpet a guided air-to-ground missile equipped with a cluster warhead. It is used at the external suspension locations of the Sukhoi Su-57. It is designed for combat duties at extended ranges and offers long-range strikes on naval and ground targets. The name Cover is verified by official sources, and illustrations of this version are included in a publication commemorating the 75th anniversary of the Sukhoi Design Bureau. The second variant, S-71M, also known as Monochrome or Monochrome, is a more advanced and autonomous unmanned aerial vehicle that features a high-explosive fragmentation-shaped charge warhead. The ordnance is available in various variants, with a maximum weight of 150 kilograms. It is capable of operating efficiently in any weather condition and at night due to its thermal imaging capabilities and electro-optical system. It is capable of loitering in the target area and independently selecting targets from a preloaded database after being launched from the Sukhoi Su-57 and potentially from the Sukhoi S-70 Okotnik Heavy Strike Unmanned Aerial Vehicle. Real-time operator guidance is also an option. The Sukhoi Su-57's internal weapons compartment can accommodate up to four of these munitions due to its design. Sergei Bogdan, the principal test pilot of the Sukhoi Design Bureau, led the successful completion of tests for both versions in April 2024 near Zhukovsky. The S-71 production process commenced in August 2024. It is presumed that the operational enhancements and simplified design that were acquired during combat use are advantageous to mass production. The S-71M is a modern combat unmanned aerial vehicle that is capable of performing precision strikes, electronic warfare, and aerial reconnaissance. The Sukhoi Su-57's tactical flexibility is further bolstered by its capabilities, which are designed to deploy and control a group of mini unmanned aerial vehicles, thereby increasing the operational radius and reducing the risk of detection. This transformation essentially turns the Sukhoi Su-57 into an airborne carrier for unmanned aerial vehicles, a capability that sets it apart from other contemporary combat aircraft. Through informational and fire pressure, this capability enables the penetration of adversary air defenses. In addition to the S-71, the Sukhoi Su-57's arsenal encompasses additional varieties of mini unmanned aerial vehicles and missiles which enhance its strike capabilities, electronic warfare capabilities, and reconnaissance capabilities. The S-71K and S-71M systems are manufactured by the Tactical Missile Armament Corporation. To guarantee independence and consistent output, 
the Tactical Missile Armament Corporation has localized the development of guidance and control systems on domestic industrial bases. It is anticipated that the S-71 and similar unmanned aerial vehicles will be integrated into a ground and air-based system in the future. This system is expected to significantly enhance the coordination and efficacy of the Russian aerospace forces in the destruction of targets, according to expert assessments. The future multi-level aviation tactic will be built upon the Sukhoi Su-57's capacity to interact with unmanned aerial vehicles, as well as other aircraft like the Sukhoi Su-35 and ground systems. The S-71 system is a highly advanced drone that has undergone enhancements. It is designed for air combat and is compatible with the Sukhoi Su-57, which significantly improves the capabilities of Russian piloted aircraft in contemporary battlefields. Its emergence suggests a significant modernization of weapon systems and the implementation of novel combat employment concepts. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, please take our channel membership, which is very affordable, to encourage us.